Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I'm a student from Guilin University of Technology. The title of my paper is Canopy LiDAR Point Cloud Date, K means Clustering Watershed Segmentation Method. I will introduce my research from the following uh, four parts background, method, experiment, conclusion. The first part is the background. On the one hand, due to Chinese regular forest resource inventory system, there is an urgent need for accurate and effective control and management of forest information. Airborne leather LiDAR technology has unique advantages over passive remote sensing technology, providing theoretical basis and technical support for the accurate extraction of single tree canopy and the uh, development of precision forestry. On the other hand, real digital images often shows a lot of local minima in their uh, gradient images, which brings a lot of water pulse. This filter becomes a watershed over uh, segmentation. The second part is method. Uh, this is a schematic diagram of the watershed algorithm. Regarding the gray image as a landform surface, a hole is punched at each uh, local minimum on the image. In these pictures, we can see water will slowly emerge into the surface from this hole, starting from the loins point. And finally, the overflow model will reach a state where only the top of the depth is exposed. The tops of these depths are water dividers and the water uh, accumulation areas that raise from uh, different local minima are called sinks or poles. We can see figure A shows a CMM to simulate the processing of loading. We first calculated the complement of the CMM as figure B, which uh, resemble two catchment basins. Assume that each basin has a hole punched at its minimum. Then we immerse it gradually into water the catchment basins will be flooded. This algorithm can be sold to automatically build dams along the divide line to prevent water into neighboring catchment basins from merging as figure C. The constructed dams are called water lines, uh, water shine lines, and will be used to partition trees. The two pictures below are made from experimental data. The experiment process of this article is shown in the figure. First, predict the uh, canopy size window. This uh, experiment will find out the nonlinear relationship, relationship between tree height and the tree crown and get the variable window size. TC is the crown diameter of each individual tree. TH is the average tree height of individual single tree. Then the CM, uh, CMM model is generated. In this paper, the CHM image is reconstructed based on the own operation. And the value of each grid unit is replaced with the maximum value of the lesser point cloud in the neighborhood to obtain the maximum uh, canopy model. 
the highest point of the local pixel maximum direction. Combined with the cone maximum model, it takes as the highest point of the tree. And then each local highest point is used as the six point of k means clustering for clustering. Step one. Uh, the first clustering center represents the pixels as the tree top loaded by the variable window. Step two. For each point, find the closest clustering center according to a given cratering and assign it to the area of this tab. Step 3. The new clustering center obtained in step 2. Step 4. When the cluster center no longer changes, the iteration is terminated. Watershed segmentation based on k-means clustering. Step 1. Suppose the image is divided into n blocks after k-means segmentation. Step 2. Define the gray variance of two adjacent blocks. Uh, step 3. Define the mean value of standard deviation of gray value of four neighborhood pixels on the edge of segmentation uh, block. Step 4. Define the similarity between two uh, adjacent cut blocks. Set a zero should value t initially to maximize the variance between classes. Step 5. Use t to drive through the uh, adjacent divided blocks. The third part is experiment. In this paper, the radius filter is used to denoise the point cloud. A circle is drawn around a point to calculate the number of points that for all sides of the circle. This paper adopts a semi-automatic pace removal method that artificial size the experiments uh, experience uh, dry shoot and rarely judges the best pace removal effect. Um, experimental results show that when using CMM model to monitor the tree top based on the local maxima, maximum value, the pseudo local maximum value can be uh, significantly uh, eliminated. And the formula of wrong and missing points in the tree top recognition can be reduced. Uh, the k-means watershed algorithm proposed in this article is compared with the traditional watershed algorithm. Uh, we can see the picture. Uh, picture A is CMM model. The picture B is uh, grayscale uh, display CMM model. The picture C is watershed algorithm. Uh, the picture D is K means clustering based on CMM. The picture E is um, grayscale display CMM K means clustering. The pH, uh, picture F is the improved watershed algorithm. Finally, a single wood segmentation result display based on k-means clustering watershed segmentation algorithm is formed. The number at the top of the tree uh, represents the tree ID. Um, the four is conclusion. Uh, it can be analyzed by the formula that the number of uh, unsplayed trees and the wrong split trees are reduced. Therefore, the segmentation result of the improved watershed algorithm is more accurate. Uh, thank you for much.